The father of 22nd Ward Alderman Ricardo Munoz was sentenced to four years in prison today. This for his role in a fake ID scheme. The scheme run by a Mexican organized crime family was exposed by the two investigators three years ago. Pam Zeckman is here now with more about the damage done by criminals using the fake IDs. Pam. Robin Ann, today prosecutors said hundreds of thousands of fake IDs were produced by the operation here in Chicago over a decade. And some of those fake IDs were used by others to pull off a $250,000 bank fraud and a $5 million eBay scam. They bought the cards at this little village shopping mall where salesmen like these signaled they had fake IDs for sale, like the driver's licenses, residency cards, and social security cards we bought for about $300 in cash. The government said today most customers were taken to this now closed photo shop for pictures to be taken by Elias Munoz. Two years ago, Munoz told me he didn't care if salesmen transacted business inside his store. They bring money in here and I work with them. Prosecutors said today they estimate the salesmen brought in $180,000 worth of business a year for Munoz, who charged $10 for each picture. And today, prosecutors showed the judge this undercover video taken by federal agents inside the photo shop of a sale being made while Munoz stood nearby. They say that you had to know what was going on. In court today, a tearful Munoz said he was sorry and asked for forgiveness. But the judge agreed with prosecutors that Munoz played an instrumental role in the scheme and sentenced him to four years in prison. Mr. Munoz, do you have anything to say about the sentence? No comment, please. After he serves time, Munoz will be turned over to immigration officials for deportation hearings. Since he pled guilty to a felony and was not here legally, he will most likely be deported. Alderman Munoz was not in court today and told me he had no comment on what happened. Robin Ann, there's absolutely no indication that Alderman Munoz had anything to do with this. Okay. Thank you, Pam.